In Hong Kong, heavy downpours very often occur during the rainy season every year, and we've been threatened with flooding for a long time. The coastal low-lying areas in northern Hong Kong Island, which mostly back onto high mountains, are particularly vulnerable to flooding. Serious flooding could plague these coastal low-lying areas during heavy downpours, particularly when it is coupled with high tide. Everyone in the drainage services department, from the frontline drain cleaning gangs to the professional engineers, have all worked diligently throughout the years with a view to continually improving the drainage system of Hong Kong and hence reducing the risk of flooding. Relieving the flooding problem of northern Hong Kong Island is one of the urgent tasks of the Drainage Services Department. In fact, the Drainage Services Department has initiated studies on innovative methods for raising the level of flood prevention of northern Hong Kong Island. One of the major flood prevention projects is the Hong Kong West Drainage Tunnel with an estimated cost of 3 billion Hong Kong dollars. The construction started in November 2007 and will take approximately five years to complete. The idea is to use tunnel boring machines to construct a main drainage tunnel about 11 kilometers in length that starts at Mid Hill and extends from Taihang to Cyberport. The project will also include the construction of 34 intakes scattered in mid levels and connecting edits with a total length of about 8 kilometers. Upon completion of the project, Storm water from the mountains will be intercepted by the intakes, then flow along the drop shaft and adits into the main tunnel. Finally, the storm water will be discharged into the sea near Cyberport. The Drainage Services Department carried out another two projects at the low lying areas in Xiongwan in 2006, namely the Xiongwan Storm Water Pumping Station and the intercepting storm water drains along Queens Road Central. Upon completion of the Xiongwan projects, part of the stormwater in Xiongwan is to be conveyed via the intercept drains to the outlets in other districts for discharge. In addition, penstock will be installed at the existing outfall in Xiongwan to prevent the upward backflow of seawater. The stormwater in the low-lying areas near Winglock Street is to be collected in an underground flood storage tank beneath the Xiongwan stormwater pumping station and then pumped out to sea. The Drainage Services Department understands that construction works may cause some inconveniences to the public. Ever since our planning started, different aspects of the works such as site selection, construction methods, and cost effectiveness have been considered with a view to minimizing disturbances to traffic, the environment, and the public at large. When these projects are completed, the capability of flood prevention for the coastal areas of northern Hong Kong Island, such as Xiong Wan, Central, Admiralty, and Wan Chai, will be effectively enhanced. The undesirable effects as a result of flooding will also be minimized. Undoubtedly, Hong Kong will benefit in the long run.